are you? I don't know. It's hard to tell. You are Daniel? Yeah, I've heard that. That must be me. Daniel Johnson. That's right. Welcome to Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada, Daniel Johnson. You good. Thank you very much. I have a gift for you right off the bat from the Vancouver band Cub. Here it is, their 7-inch Betty Cola. Oh, that looks good. That looks pretty good. With cover art by Dan DiCarlo. Oh, no kidding. That is cool. He's great. I love those. I buy Archie comics a lot. Those girls look so foxy. I always buy them. And you know what's really... And you know what's really amazing about it? They actually cover, and I got another gift for you. This is on their CD. They cover Tell Me Now. All right. By Daniel Johnson. How about that. This is great. And they're from Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada. What do you think about that? Getting Dan DiCarlo. Yeah, the, yeah, he's cool. I mean, those girls look like real foxes and babes on that. Uh, Archie's comics. And I have another gift for you. And check this out. This is the Beatles playing in Vancouver. That is so cool. Thanks so much. That's on my wall. They're playing where? At Empire Stadium in Vancouver. Oh, that is so cool. So Boris Karloff worked Frank at the PE. Brothers, Jackie, uh, the Excel. <laughs> Okay. No, it doesn't stop there, Daniel Johnson. I have another gift for you, another P and E Vancouver gift. Okay. Check this out. We have here a record of Beatles interviews. Are you at the Beatles interview? I sure am. I collect Beatles. All that. Beatles interviews. Looked out today. Now, check this out, Daniel Johnson. It is Beatles interviews in Seattle and Vancouver. Seattle and Vancouver specific Beatles interviews. Yeah, that's great. some local content. Yeah. I guess that's what I was wondering about. I was looking at the devil and Daniel Johnson, and I saw this record on your Christmas tree, Ed Rudy. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. Can you tell the people about hanging Ed Rudy on your Christmas tree? This is like a spoken word record, the spoken word yeah. Beatles, Beatles thing. Freaky Christmas that, that year. So that's cool. Can I have this too? Uh, that maybe isn't quite for you. In there. Some of the interviews are actually on the CD. That'll be cool. You can actually check out. And that's what I want to ask you about. What do you think, Daniel Johnson, about records like this? Oh, it's not the Beatles, is it? I, I understand that, but they're, it's collectible. I have some, a lot of Beatles sound like records and I collect them. That's the Liverpool. So have you been fooled ever thinking it is the Beatles? Well, uh, not really, but they, I, like, like they have just a little bit more hair when the Beatles. It was funny because you know, it's like they get a bunch of session men in for you know Beatlemania or they call it something. That's cool. Cliff is your number one fan in Vancouver. Come over here, Cliff. Right? Hey, Daniel. And he wondered if you could trade some comics for some gig tickets tonight. We got a and Action Comics number two hundred and sixty-nine. Yeah. Identity has been betrayed by Black Magic. Poor that? Superman. That's yeah, for you. Very good. Complete run of Black Goliath, issues uh, one through two. That is great. The party's over punks. There's a new yeah. superhero in town. Yeah. For you. Not quite a monster magazine, but a monster comic. How about that? That's a great cover. Who, who did that cover? I'm not sure. Rick Spuckler. These are all gifts from Cliff. <laughs> right. <laughs> for gig tickets. There's some Jack Kirby inside this monster comic, yeah. Monsters on the Prowl. Cool. That is monster cool. And for you. So I really appreciate that. Sort of well, how many tickets do you want? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> How many tickets do you need? Uh, four, but... Uh, <laughs> well, tell my brother there. Tell my brother, and he'll write your name down and, and let you in at the door. Oh, amazing. Very much. And the House of Secrets, uh, sort right. of a horror. Ice cream cone gone bad. And the, and the final one, Archie in Vancouver yeah, at Expo 86. Yeah, there they are. The Archie's playing in Vancouver on stage. Right. We'll have to book more Canadian concerts. <laughs> Shouldn't we be singing in French? All done by Dan DiCarlo. Now, from football with Flock of Seagulls to working in an oil refinery with a girl. What was that like, working at the oil refinery with a girl? Well, there were girls at the oil refinery, so I made it kind of fun to the day to joke around and stuff. But like the other day when I tried, when, you know, you can't harass girls too much. Like, I, I've been gotten in trouble a few times with the stewardesses and, uh, you know, so I, don't, I, I leave the girls alone. I don't bother them as much. You know, I used to just you know have them fun, have fun with the stewardess. You know, can you get me another drink? I have no, you know, something like that. What role did this gentleman have here in your life? Here we have Mr. Kim Fowley. All right, this is cool. I I never uh, he wanted to do a record with me, you know, and I told him sorry. I said uh, yeah, you know, and so he wanted to see what I sound like in the studio that I could do some studio recording. <clears throat> And when I did, I thought to myself, I'd say, hey, I'll go ahead and record an album. You know, so it was a continued story, was the album. But I never really met him. But he had a letter for me about, I'd like to work with him someday. You know, very famous Joan Jett and Cherry Bomb, songs like that. 
All right. Daniel Johnson, you were on MTV Cutting Edge. One person that doesn't get a lot of credit was the host of the show. What can you tell the people about Peter Zaremba from the Flesh Tones? He was the host. Do you remember him? That's right. Yeah, he was so cool. He, he the flesh. I love the Flesh Tones. He got me on the show. I just showed up. They were having a lunch, you know, and we were all eating tacos, and I was like talking to him and holding up my tape to the camera and everything. And, Smooth sailing. I was famous. MTV. People talk about MTV, but the Flesh Tones. At the time. But it goes back to the Flesh Tones. Peter Zaremba. Yeah, they, I, I really like the music. I've heard them before, a, a bit of them. And do I get to have this? Probably not. Yes, that's for you. Thanks. I appreciate it. That'd be great. Daniel, here we are with Brett. Hi, Brett. Hi, Daniel. <laughs> and you got a tune for us. You sure do. This is an old song from Songs of Pain era. If I had my own way, you'd be with me here today. But I rarely have my own way. I guess that's why you're not here with me today. And the librarian said, You can't buy no respect. I said, Hey, lady, what can you expect when I'm lying on the floor? Well, you're a lovely lady, but you don't want to be no girl of mine. Well, the only thing you ever done for me was help me waste my time. And I saw you at the funeral. You were standing there like a temple. I said, hi, how are you? Hello. And I pulled up a casket and crawled in. Yes, I did. Climbed up a mountain and I looked around Some kind of circus with all them clowns I said, hey, wait a minute, can't we slow down a bit? And I almost got hit by a truck well, it just goes to show you that we're all on our own Scrounging for our own share of good luck Stab your brother in the back And pick up your paycheck Goodbye, lonely heart drawing You never did work anyhow I'm looking for a nice girl And I don't want no cow I'm heading out west Gonna find me the best Well, I played the game But I failed the test If I can't be a lover Then I'll be a pest Yes, I will Yes, I will. Yes, I will. Thank you. Amazing. Thank you very much. Daniel Johnson, live at the comic shop. How about it? How about it? Live at the comic shop in Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada. You know it. With yeah. bread as well. Yeah. Thank you very much for having us. A friend from my uh, college. We went to college together. Well, anything else you want to add to the people out there at all, Daniel Johnson? Hmm, I don't know. Anything to add to the people? Uh, they used to say power to the people, right? I don't know. Right on. Yeah. Right, power. <laughs> All right, well, thanks so much, Daniel and Brett. Right. Keep on rocking in the free world and do do the loot do. Yeah, uh, cat me and do. Almost. Do do the loot do. Oh, do do. Yeah. Right, okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Hey, I, I really did pretty well with all this loot.